An event indicates a change in an environment, such as an AWS environment, a SaaS partner service or application, or one of your applications or services. For example, Amazon EC2 generates an event when the state of an instance changes from pending to running. An AWS step function state machine finishes executions, it also generates an event too. There's also the concept of scheduled events, which are events that run on a periodic basis. Typically, these could be used to perform a task every day or every few minutes. Events are represented in JSON, and they all have a similar structure and the same top-level fields. The contents of the detailed top-level field are different depending on which service generated the event and what the event is. The combination of the source and detail type fields serve to identify the fields and values found in the detail field. For examples of events generated by AWS services, visit s12d.com forward slash events dash one. For custom applications, you can also generate events. Here's an example of a custom event from the Innovator Island workshop. The source shows that the event came from themepark.rides, and the detail type indicates that this is an outage. The detail field shows more information. This attribute contains stringified JSON before it's put onto the event bus. This event can then be sent to the event bus by using the CLI command. The response shows if this command was successful or not. An event can be up to 256 kilobytes in size, and when you send an event to EventBridge, it's always associated with a single specified event bus. For more resources on learning about events, go to s12d.com forward slash about events.